The Forest Detective, case number 14. There's a rock in the forest. Anything that goes by that rock will undoubtedly get attacked by something invisible. Hmm. By something invisible? Invisible monster? This phantom has all the forest insects shaking. Who is this invisible monster? Hmm. Invisible monster? That's just impossible. It must be something that attacks super fast. Ow! Oh, 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 oh. What was that? Ow! Uh, uh. There's no one here. There's no way. It could have been an invisible... Monster! Stop fooling around and let's... Move out! This is the spot. Oh. Oh. Huh? What was that? Was, was it the invisible monster? Oh boy, you just slept on the moss. Oh. The invisible insect predator must be hiding somewhere on this rock. Let's go find him. <laughs> please, oh please don't come out. <laughs> Reveal yourself. <laughs> oh. hmm. I don't see anything hiding here. <gasps> What's that? Is it oh. the invisible monster? Uh. Oh. I don't think so. You said invisible monsters don't exist, scaredy cat. Uh, <clears throat> who are you? Huh? Are you the culprit? Huh? Culprit for what? I'm just going on my way across this rock. You, you can't. can't! The invisible monster might attack you! Don't be silly. I just examined the entire rock. There's nothing here. It's all clear. Uh, you sure? Okay, then. Yeah. So then, what is it that attacked those insects? Ah! Oh. 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 Out of nowhere, something grabbed me and tried to pull me down! Just now? Show yourself! Okay. Hmm, there's no one here except us. Taking pictures won't help us now! I'm positive the culprit's hiding nearby. He attacked like lightning and then ran away. Let's search around the rock! We investigated all the animals around the rock, but... The toad isn't quick enough to be our culprit. Oh boy, and the earthworm is even slower. <laughs> they were much too slow to be our guy. If it's none of them, then who on earth attacked those insects? We need to do a more thorough search of the rock. <laughs> <laughs> the caterpillar was attacked right around here. <laughs> this area looks slightly different from before. Molly, take some more pictures of this spot. Oh, will do. <laughs> we compared the picture taken earlier with the most recent one. I knew it, this spot right here. The pattern of the moss has changed. Oh. Moss? Does that mean there really was an invisible monster right there in that spot? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> it 
invisible monster or not, I, the great forest detective, will find the culprit! Which one of you made that thing? I made uh, it. It's Pete the Caterpillar. <sighs> We're going to lure the culprit with our fake caterpillar. Oh. Ow! My arms hurt! How about we take turns? <laughs> uh, Pooh Baba! <laughs> I can't see anything, but I can feel it pulling! Oh, an invisible monster it has to be! Is it really an invisible? Uh? It's not! It's just a piece of moss! Uh? Uh, it's not a real caterpillar! The moss is. the moss is moving! Apparently, it wasn't a piece of moss. It was an insect that camouflaged itself with moss, the Dendrolean Jesuensis. The culprit lives on mossy rocks. It covers its body with moss and hides in the cracks of rocks. Perfectly camouflaged in its mossy suit, totally hidden from plain sight. It was able to hunt insects like a phantom. Case number 14. Another mystery is solved. Uh, but where did everybody go? Uh, uh, Molly? Uh, Baba! Uh, uh, where are they? <laughs> we camouflaged ourselves like the Dendro Leon. <laughs> The mystery is solved!